Hey guys, Josh here again, and today I will be showing off and doing a quick shooting test of one of my newest slingshots, and already one of my favorites. This is my Gen 2 Forge Starship. I'll show you it up close. It has a 3 inch PVC arm brace, which fits nicely on my arm. That has been super glued to the end of my quarter inch steel rod, which has been bent to form uh, the frame. This is a 3 8 inch piece of solid square mild steel for the handle with a half inch bit of PEX pipe um, over top of that with some electrical tape. And then here I have the fork. I've bent it into shape so that it's ergo ergonomic for me so I don't have to turn my wrist all the way over. I can just keep it here in a comfortable position. And this is a 3 quarter inch Baltic birch plywood uh, fork. And this is actually the top section of the Ferret Hunter by Bill Hayes, which is my uh, pretty much my favorite slingshot design of all time. So it basically incorporates everything I love from the Ferret Hunter into a more stable Starship. So it is just a fantastic slingshot. Be doing a shooting test for you guys today. And uh, I really hope you enjoy. Okay, here I am at about 10 yards with my uh, Forge Starship. And I'll be shooting uh, 3 8 steel as usual. And I want to see how many times I can hit this duct tape target in a row. So uh, I think my record so far is like four, but I've only been shooting for a few minutes. So hopefully I can do better than that. I think I nicked that one. I counted as three. That's, uh, what is that? Is that four or five? So I didn't do amazing, but uh, as you can see, it's incredibly consistent. It uh, takes everything I love about the Ferret Hunter frame, all the accuracy and and uh, just shootability of it, and uh, puts it on a Starship. Automatically gives it more power, a little bit more stability and uh, consistency. I don't think it's quite as accurate as my Ferret Hunter, uh, maybe just because I've had more practice with it. But it's definitely more consistent. It's easier to shoot because all the a lot of variables are eliminated automatically um, because of the arm brace. So I'll do a little bit more shooting for you guys uh, from some different distances, possibly maybe some different targets, and uh, that'll be my video. Okay, here we are at 20 yards, and I'll attempt to hit that uh, little tiny olive can off, and I'll do uh, this cool uh, view. I had a request to do uh, more shots like this, so here you go. Dang, this thing shoots fast. <laughs> that 
That was awesome. So there you go, guys. My uh, first real forged starship. It's no longer a prototype. This is uh, my first final design, I guess. I'll do uh, more designs when I get the chance. I have a bunch of uh, advice, I guess I should say, um, ideas uh, that forum members have proposed. So eventually when I have time, I will get around to trying some of those. I'm just really swamped right now, so I don't think uh, I'll be building much for a while. But I wanted to share this with you guys. It is already one of my favorite things in my collection. I mean, it's just absolutely awesome. It combines everything I love. The Ferret Hunter uh, forks, the forged frame, the consistency of a starship, the speed of the flat bands. It's just awesome, and it looks cool. It's It doesn't quite look finished, I admit, but I like it that way. I don't like to shoot, uh, like, just gorgeous slingshots. I just can't shoot them. <laughs> When I have ugly slingshots that work well, then I'm more likely to pick them up when I go out to shoot. So, anyway, really hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to check out some of the other links in the video and in the description below. And uh, make sure to check out some of my other shooting videos. Uh, I think you will like what you see. I have multiple playlists on my channel to choose from. And if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe. I'll have the link above my head somewhere. And uh, make sure to like and share and comment all that stuff. I love uh, talking to you guys, so make sure to leave me some feedback on what you thought of this video. So, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next Tuesday. Bye.